Hello YouTube, how's it going? Uh, haven't posted it up, posted up in quite a while. Uh, quick update, um, I finished school, so now all I'm doing is doing what the man wants, which is just working. Um, also, uh, I'm in the new, I have a new pad, so I'm, I'm out of my parents. I finally have uh, my own spot, so I have a big garage for myself. Um, also, uh, Friday the 13th, the best thing happened. I was leaving the pick and pull and I was driving back home. I was literally like a mile away from the pick and pull and bam, a scrap of metal was on the floor and I didn't even see it. I ran it over my Del Sol and it punctured my oil pan. And the good thing is that when that scrap metal went underneath my car, I was like, holy shit, what could it be? Cause it was pretty high. The scrap metal was probably a Probably like a foot off the ground, but it was twisted metal. I thought it was like plastic, but it wasn't. I pulled over in the arch road next to the pig and pull. And uh, thankfully it did that. And then um, when I parked it, I noticed there was a long trail behind my car and it was oil. And I looked underneath my car and there was a vast amount of oil just coming down from the, from the bottom. So I had to get my car towed on Friday the 13th. Uh, also, a day after, I was selling one of my my PS Vitas, and um, they were my girl's CRX, and her distributor bearings go bad. What luck, right? So, I had to get that car towed the next day, but, uh, and on that same day, I fixed her car, just because uh, she commutes to school in Sac State, so... She's more of a priority than me because I work locally. And um, thankfully my dad allowed me to borrow his car. But I haven't worked yet because I'm trying to fix my car so I can start driving it tomorrow. But uh, yeah. And then two days after uh, what happened to my girl, my sister crashes, which was yesterday. And um, she was with her baby, which was only a year old, and my other sister. But thankfully they're all okay. You know, it's just, <laughs> it's been nuts. These things, these occurrences that have been happening, um, but you know, can't do anything about it. All you can do is move forward, and that's it. So what I did uh, before yesterday, uh, <clears throat> I was at the pick and pull again, and uh, my brother-in-law went with me, and uh, I got a an oil pan for my Delso. It was from a B18, a LS. Uh, those work on B16s. They have the same exact oil pan, so now you guys know if you ever need an oil pan, and there's a crap ton of B18s, the LS's, at Pick and Pull, so now you know. Uh, GSRs don't fit, by the way. And, um, yeah, all I'm doing right now is just cleaning it up, purple power, clean the crap out of it. Now I'm trying to remove the oil pan gasket, which we all know is really fun to remove because it comes off so easily. Not, but that's what I'm doing right now, just cleaning it up before I install it. And, yeah, so hopefully... By uh, by today, my car will be running. I need an oil change anyway, so <laughs> yeah. All right, you guys. Well, I'm gonna go, and I'll just show you my car how it is right now before I before I end. So have a have a good one, y'all. Like and subscribe, whatever you know. Do what you please. Ask questions. I will always answer. Uh, yeah. Here's the car. Yeah, first gear, my girl, <laughs> turn on your car and hit the wall right there. But yeah, here she is. Ready for the new oil pan. And here's the new oil pan. But yeah, you guys, have a good one. Um, this is everything. Peace.